That's music to the ears of Quincy Maddock. The physical nature, it's hands-on. It's one of the sports that I can actually do. I don't have to think, I don't have to adapt really. Adapting is the name of the game for Quincy, who was born visually impaired. I have light perception, so that means I can just see the light and the dark, but no color, no shadows, no shapes. A student at the Colorado School for the Deaf and Blind, Quincy has tried all kinds of adaptive sports, including beat baseball and skiing, but none compared to judo. Judo called to me more. Um, it just, I get more um, enjoyment out of judo. It has opened up her world so much in terms of physical activity, in terms of um, really feeling like she can be successful at a sport and it has given her an opportunity to give her every ounce of effort that she has in her. Like any judo athlete, the Paralympics are the ultimate goal, even if Quincy won't admit it. I mean, I'm hoping to get high. I know I don't know if I'll go to the Paralympics, but I do want to get do, do some competing and stuff. Um, I don't know, you know, what, what the time period looks like yet, really, but I, I definitely want to work out, get some competitions in. I want her to reach whatever her goal is. Um, if her goal is the Paralympics for judo, that's what I wish for her, and that's what I will support for her. Um, ultimately, it is long-term physical fitness, though. I want her to do judo for her whole life um, because she loves it so much, and it works so well for her.